outside. I've got to go away. Baby, it's cold outside. So, currently, I'm just, you know, Christmas shopping. Um, my head is killing me so much right now. Like, it hurts so bad. Like, just go away. My mom always has headaches, so I feel like I'm, like, inheriting that. But she always has, like, multiple day headaches. And I'm like, oh, that must be bad. But, like, now that I've actually had a multiple day headache, it sucks, guys. Like, it hurts so bad, and you don't get a break. Which is so annoying. So, yeah. That's, that's my update. But I'm currently Christmas shopping for my dad. I'm Christmas shopping for my mom for my dad because, okay, so basically my dad wants to obviously get stuff for my mom, but like he's really busy. So he was like, can you just, like I sent him all the stuff that my mom wants and he's like, can you just order it? And I was like, sure. You choose, choose to turn the page. That means I have been a good child. Of course. If I have, you should be sure to let me know I have been. I'm sure I'd be ecstatic. Not sure how you spell it, so you probably won't, not flipping the page. But I'm just letting you know that you give me the best gift every day by being amazing parents. So no gifts are actually needed. Aww. You're just the nicest. That's how you get the good presents. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's yours now. Okay. okay, now I have to go do homework. I'm feeling better though, so that's good. I'm probably gonna feel bad again in the morning, but you just gotta push through it because I can't miss any more schoolwork. So I have this cooking series that I intend to show a lot of during Vlogmas because it's so fun and you guys love it. Like, I don't know why, but yeah, I guess it's entertaining to watch me like mess up when I'm making food, I don't know. But currently making some ramen, some packaged ramen, so like it doesn't really count. Oh no, it's really ready. Okay, one second. Good morning guys, so I think we all know by now, um, I stayed home again because I literally woke up. Last night I stayed up till like 2 in the morning um, along with the other night, like I didn't mean to, I just couldn't fall asleep. And then my mom was down here watching the show at like 11.50, mom you should go to sleep but <laughs> whatever. And I came down and I was talking to her and she was like, I was really stressed and I was just thinking about forcing myself to go to school today because I was like I can't miss any more work and like I just I was stressed and my mom's like you need to get better before school like your health is more important than school like you're gonna live with yourself your whole life you're not gonna live with this school for your whole life like you need to get better first so like don't make your decision if you're gonna go to school or not um based on like based on like getting work done and stuff so I was feeling horrible this morning this morning. I was it was like so foggy um My mom slept with me because the night before I like felt so sick and I just like needed my mom so She slept with me because I have like a huge bed <laughs> um And for those of you that's gonna say it's gross whatever like I don't even care but um basically in the morning like I my mom was like, do you want the curtains open? And I couldn't even, like, think. I couldn't even make the decision. So, I was like, I can't go to school. And when I do schoolwork, it just gets worse. Like, I was doing homework last night. And my head was fine. Like, you guys saw last night. I was, like, feeling a lot better. And then I did schoolwork. And then it kind of went downhill. That was, like, after I stopped vlogging for the night. Because my camera ran out of space. But, yeah. Um, I've been relaxing for a really long time. My mom's actually at a meeting for, um, this 
benefit type thing. I'll explain it more later or another time, but basically it's for the Dis Dakota Access Pipeline. If you don't know what that is, it's like this horrible thing you guys need to like look it up. I'm wearing the shirt right now. It says the Be Nice Party. Um, but my mom is like trying to get to be part of this benefit organization type thing where they like build houses on um, Native American res reservations and that's really important because like no one really knows how bad you know the life is on reservation and people like make a joke like the res car like a res cat which is like rough you know really rough but my mom was trying to get a part of that because if you don't know we are Native American um I'm white, but that doesn't mean I'm not Native American. Like, my dad's white, my mom's Native American, so, like, I got my dad's eyes, I got my dad's face, <laughs> I got my dad's eyebrows, I got my dad's whiteness, but I am Native American. Whether I show it or not, I am, like, I don't care what people say, like, oh, you're not, you're white, whatever, like, I don't care. So, um, yeah. So, I just filmed an Ipsy unboxing, which is kind of funny, because I thought my subscription ended last July, and I just got that. I don't know. But I missed like the October one, the September one, like a bunch of other ones, but it's okay. It's okay. Um, but I just got a bunch of my mom's Christmas presents. I ordered her like a lot of books, like cool books. Um, I'll show you guys them. Um, they're all from Amazon, in case you're wondering, but I found all of them on Urban Outfitters. Like I usually look at Urban Outfitters because they have like really cool books. But then I found them on Amazon for like half the price. So my mom's always telling me how like she wants to get rid of a bunch of clothes, but like she doesn't know what to get rid of, and she doesn't know what outfits to wear. Do we? <laughs> um, so I got her this. It's a curated closet, and it says a simple system for discovering your personal style and building your dream wardrobe. Um, so I think he's gonna love this, and it matches her uh, dressing room. And then this, my mom is obsessed, obsessed, like. When I say obsessed, I mean totally obsessed with California. Like, she loves California. We used to live there. But, um, this is see San Francisco through the lens of a, um, something, something. Blah, blah, blah. But, look at that. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with it. She's gonna love it so much. Like, this is her. This is what makes her super happy. So, it's like, it'll be perfect. And they both, like, match her closet and stuff in her like room so yeah I'm gonna grab them for the winter's the tree what up guys so um I'm feeling good as good as a sick girl could feel honestly um I'm it's 224 and I'm watching the, the how the Grinch stole Christmas I watched this two days ago and I'm obsessed with it, guys. I'm also eating puppy. But I'm obsessed with How the Grinch Stole Christmas. It's like my favorite movie ever. So I'm watching it again. Because, I mean, I could watch it all year round, but then I'd get excited for Christmas. So I'm just like taking advantage and watching it like every single week. During the Christmas time. Sorry if this 